Hi there everyone. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing video of my latest watch purchase. Today we're going to be looking at the Marlowe Derwent Gauge. Uh, Marlowe is a watch company out of Great Britain. I don't know much about them. Um, I came across them by looking at some watches on the Watch You Seek forum and I like the look of them. Um, started doing some research and realized that they were in my price point. Um, uh, the models that I was interested in was their hand-wound model, and that's what the Derwent uh, is. Uh, the other thing that was appealing for me is I've got small wrist and uh, came in a 38 millimeter. I bought it directly off of their website, I paid $307, and uh, let's take a look at it. For those of you that have never seen my videos before, I'm not a professional. I just do these videos to help out other customers who might be interested in the same product and to just document when I got an item, um, just for memory's sake. Well, let's take a look at the box that comes in. This watch shipped from Great Britain. I'm down here in the United States in Texas. I got it in about four days, which I thought was pretty fast uh, shipping. Uh, even though it's made in Great Britain, it does have a Miota 6T33 uh, movement, so it's not an in-house movement, It's uh, which a lot of these companies use Miota movements or Seiko movements. Um, looks like the company was established in 2015. This is my first hand-wound watch, so I'm kind of excited about it. I've got several automatic watches. I also have several dive watches. I don't really have any casual watches and that's what was appealing for me for this watch is I wanted something I could wear to the office um, and then save my dive watches for the weekend. Oh sorry, this is the the back of the insert. Looks like it's uh, just a little bit of information about the company but thank you for the purchase. So let's take it out and take a look at it. Wow, it is really light. It's uh, 38 millimeters, um, but man, it is thin. I expected a, and again, I've never had a manual wound watch, but the automatic watches I have are usually pretty thick and big, and this one's uh, definitely not thick. Hopefully you can see the case back. I've never seen a case back like that, but it's kind of cool. The one reservation I did have when I was researching this watch is that crystal is an acrylic crystal and I've never had an acrylic crystal since back in the 80s when I had a Swatch watch. Um, but for $307 I figured you couldn't get too picky. I would have liked to have seen a mineral crystal or a sapphire crystal. Um, but since I'm just wearing it to the office I'm hoping the acrylic crystal will be, will be fine. The strap is a nice soft leather. So anyway, there's the unboxing video. Maybe I'll do some uh, follow-up videos with the watch on my wrist. Appreciate you watching. Feel free if you've got any questions about this watch. I love talking watches. I'd love to help you out. Uh, just post your question in the video, and I'll do my best to respond as quick as possible. Thanks for watching.